Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Ashanti T. Listen, this is the new home of gossip. We're going to be talking about beauty. When we talk about pop culture, honey, we're going to dive into some things over here. We're going to have a lot of tea. So I'll just make sure you guys subscribe and get ready. I'm going to be coming for some of your favorite YouTubers. I hate it for you, but I don't hate it for me. Um, also, yeah, you know, I'm all about positive eyes, but... Good morning, y'all. Child, Britney Spears talks about ah, her mama and her was drinking underage, child. It says in the book, Underage. Drinking with her mother started a braid. She's so thankful. What are you thankful for, Brittany? Um, Brittany, you should probably put everything in the book and stop talking about it before it comes out because it's starting to sound a little, um, what's the girl said last night? Mediocre. Um, it's starting to sound a little. Something's going on here. Okay. Stop it. Another person that needs to stop it. Haney Baby Trolls fans, a mom pregnancy rumors with a picture on social media. First of all, she took a picture. Um, that's an old ass picture. Okay. We're not going to sit here out of that's a new picture. Your waist is not that snatch. We just saw you in um, Walmart where you were going looking like you were going to Walmart with those um, big ass clothes on to try to hide your belly and you can't hide it no more. Um, the thing is, you put that dumb ass capsule in there talking about. Um, I'm like a grandma with peppermint. Girl, bye. Victoria Monet's actually outdoing you and your sister and seeing even the best. Speaking of not being the best, Haley Bailey gets awarded at the Glamour Award, Woman of the Year, Gen Z, Reward, whatever the hell that is. Girl, here's the thing. Um, they put out in a Glamour magazine that she was happily married and she got a baby and this, this, and that. The truth of the matter is they said that she was actually, they made a mistake and put somebody else interview up there. Girl, they're lying to us in our face. The thing of the matter is she wants to kind of sneak Keep sneak it out there without actually saying what it was. Get the public prepared. Bitch, bye. Another bitch who should be saying bye. Jenna Pika, aka Low Down Dirty, saying defends uh, using science, Scientologists to uh, homeschool their kids. Scientology. Sorry, guys, I said Scientologists. It looks like they are all at the Scientologist church on um and, and out there in LA and look like they're all cloned they all ashy looking on this picture they're all wiped out Willow look like a fool of in, in a science project speaking of a fool in a science project singer Selena Gomez unfollows singer Dua, uh, Dua Lupa um uh, the intern around and says it was an accident girl trying to clean it up girl Selena Gomez unfollow her because um let me tell you why Allegedly, Taylor Swift is jealous of Dua Lupa because Dua Lupa came and slayed the girls. And Selena Goldmatt's jealous of everybody because she can't make it because she has anxiety. She's always like stealing people organs and stuff like that. And the girls from this, how to get away with murder. Y'all know she's on that show called uh, All the Murders in the Building. Shout out, she is a fool because she, let me tell you something, something about an uh, old girl. It should be called All the Fillers in the Face. Her face is fat as hell. She looks like a cat. I, I can't stand this girl. She's trying to get sympathy and payola. Anyway, uh, but she's best friend of Taylor Swift and they just was out in West Hollywood. So I'm pretty sure that that's what prompt the unfollow. Um, anyway, make sure you guys are following me, by the way, as describe and comment. Okay. Florida rapper, City Girls, a.k.a. the knockoff salt and pepper, are expected to sell 6 to 8K first week on new album. Should JT go so low? What child? Shit, it, it don't matter if she goes slow, low or not. Because the number that she's getting is still the same. She's still going to be a floppyana. And these two people are just, they're just terrible, raw. And I'm giving it to you guys raw. The thing gonna matter is the only reason why I, I I got a I got a feeling okay the only reason I like J T is because there's no other rapper out besides Nicki Minaj that's great and I'm looking for another person we're all looking for someone so we we don't care if they come in in a in in in, in a suit box or if they come in a in in a jet bitch we just want a new rapper that's a good rapper you know we love Nicki but we want people that can give us some competition where are they oh and another thing. Listen, I say I want Nicki Minaj to have um, some type of competition, right? The thing that matter is no one can peace for her. She can peace for herself. Okay, I just want a good artist out there. Like, where is the fucking artist? Where is the people that used to rap on the street that we can just discover and stop getting these girls that one day they look like a regular girl and then the next day they all blowed up, you know, in the face, Miami. 
girl there's some news and some tea and some things i want to talk about and i'm excited about it the first thing i want to talk about is new podcast alert child looks like og reality stars needy lee and bethany bethany has a new limited podcast coming soon called bethany i don't know bethany i'm through with it i'm done with it I, I always was done with it from the moment you went on the show and sat down with her now, on the flip side of things, I also believe that this podcast is going to be great because Nene Leaks is the truth. She's the OG. She's the HBIC. Um, Bethany is good at talking and looking like a blow-up doll. Uh, the thing is, their contract is going to be great. I actually like Bethany's business mind. Um, but all the other stuff, I see straight, straight through her skeleton face. Um, but I think them two are going to go great. I think she's the only one that's helping Nene out doing this hate train. Notice I said hate train. Okay. Okay, guys, I also think that it's good to see in this culture, I mean, in this time, um, for younger kids and for people to see whites and black working together. Um, I think that's very, very, very important. And I, um, I like this. And I also think that it's great to see a white woman in power um, pick up a black woman in power. Okay, Kazini is not done. It. She's going to rise above all hands. She's going to do it. Okay, watch. Speaking of whites and blacks working together, um, the City Girls came out with a video featuring um, Mabu, what's her name? Kim Petra. And um, it looks like to me that um, this is a great collab. Um, it was cool, it was great. Miami can't rap, but she looks beautiful. Um, JT, um, you did great. Your bars was on point. Um, Kim Petra is that girl, the girl in the picture. Okay, guys, I'm going to end this episode. So my producers just warned me, told me to have to say allegedly. So allegedly, 